breaking smoking gun evidence that John McCain is a traitor. Well, 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 what do we have here? It appears that Senate double agent John McCain may have some serious explaining to do according to True Pundit. Thanks to Judicial Watch, we know that McCain has searched high and low for a rumored dossier that had damning information on President Trump. In the book, Rogue Spooks, the Intelligence War on Donald Trump, authors Dick Morris and Eileen McGann state that McCain attended the Global Anti-Trump Intelligence Conference in Halifax, Canada from November 17th to 20th last year. He was accompanied by former Hillary State Department employee David Kramer, who now works for the Arizona State University's McCain Institute for Int International Leadership. While there, McCain met up with Sir Andrew Wood, who was Britain's former ambassador to Russia. Sir Woods was a close associate of M16 spy and author of the fake Russian dossier on Trump. Christopher Steele. It was agreed that the dossier would be handed over to Kramer at a later date. It was intentionally reported that McCain pursued the dossier out of a patriotic duty to bring down a dangerous Donald Trump. That, like much of McCain's comments regarding the dossier, turns out to be highly exaggerated. True Pundit reports that last week's revelations that former FBI Director James Comey a SOP for Hillary, funded the acquisition fee of $100,000 for what turned out to be a hypothetical opposition research, pales in comparison to the following bit of surprising news. It is now being revealed by uh, British court papers in relation to a lawsuit against Steele that part of the one hundred grand may have come from McCain putting to the uh, lie that he just had to turn over the dossier to Comey as nothing but an intentional perversion of he absolutely wanted to peddle false information that he hoped would lead to a coup against the president. It is growing increasingly clear that when the Trump-hating media networks turned up their noses at such obvious uh, malarkey found in the dossier, McCain panicked that his investment would be for naught and dropped it in the lap of loyal deep state soldier James Comey. From that moment, Comey legitimized the bogus information by calling for a special counsel to look into the claims. This was an intentional intelligence community setup of a president to find the conspiratorial New World Order agenda. At the heart of the scheme was John McCain, fake patriot, fake man of honor, but total sellout. If there was justice in this world, he would be standing blindfolded before a firing squad right about now. Absolutely. Along with uh, McCain, uh, I mean, excuse me, along with Hillary, uh, Comey, and uh, uh, Obama and all of them, basically, uh, and, and Soros, let's not forget him, you know? They all deserve that. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.